my name is Shannon Kern Simmons, and I am proud and honored to be one of your future licensed and certified spiritual practitioners here. Yeah. So, um, there's so many things that I want to share with you, but I know that we're kind of limited to two or so minutes, so um, I'll just share a few things that come to my heart from the big things that have risen to the surface when I was asked to give. Um, to share my experience. Um, and the first thing is, I guess I want to say that I grew up with a family that had great abundance, but was always focused on lack and limitation and worry and panic and not enough money. And when I look back at my family, I think, oh my God, we had these huge dinners and we always had enough. And my parents helped my brother and I get through school and everything always felt so abundant as I look back, but, in, it, but when I was in it, it was always like, we never have enough, we never have enough, there's never enough, there's not enough. Um, and so that's what I grew up with, that worldview um, for years and years into my adulthood. And so um, I didn't come to the Center for Spiritual Living until 2006. I hurt my back, and David Dixon, who was my practitioner, at the, or my, um, my chiropractor, he had said, well, why don't you come to this place called Center for Spiritual Living. And I said, uh-uh, I don't do places, thank you. Um, I don't, you know, I had, got burned by a religion and past experiences, and I was good just the way I was. Um, but I was curious, and he said, there's a great um, teacher, Reverend Dr. Peter Waldus, the music is amazing, you should come. And so my husband and I kind of got here early. And one of the things I didn't tell um, the first service was we met Petra outside the door, and I said, are you Reverend Petra? And she said, it's Petra. And I thought, oh my god, like, this is just not going well for me. Um, <laughs> and so, um, so we came and stayed, and um, with some skepticism, curiosity, and hope, we came and we stayed. And um, we stayed for a few years, and then my husband and I fell on um, hard personal times and just disappeared. And what I'm so grateful about, one of the things is that you can go away and you can come back and there's no shame, blame, or judgment about that. Um, and we had gotten tools over those first two years that allowed us to navigate through marriage challenges and financial challenges and so many challenges. And um, I returned to the center fully when I was to take on a managerial job, which is, yeah, not part of my skill set, but that's how God is growing me. Um, and I thought I need more tools. Um, and so, um, and I'm coming back to my true purpose, which is simply allowing myself to be, to live, to give my gifts, and to be unafraid. Um, and so I took a, um, a class called Prosperity Plus, which invited us to tithe 10% of all of our earnings. And I was like, oh, that's the last bastion in my financial um, growth. And I did it, and I lived, and I lived even more fully. And it was called Prosperity Plus and a New Way of Living. I found my gratitude practice. I found I've continued to meditate and pray and to give and to be unafraid. And I never thought that I would do all of that and even more. And I, what the center has given me is my life. It has given me my grace. It has given me my ease. It has given me my peace. It has saved my marriage. It has given me peace in the most challenging situations. It allowed me to navigate and assist my beautiful, blessed mother-in-law um, through her transition and so much more. I am so grateful to be here with you all. I am so grateful to have my life back. My spirit says, oh yeah, when you like made it to the planet, you just forgot um, who you were. And um, I continue to evolve and expand and evolve my consciousness and evolve consciousness as a whole. And I'm so very, very grateful to be here as a part of this community, which I can say is my home. And um, it welcomes all paths and it allowed me to make my own and to make peace with my relationship with God and to celebrate it and love it and be it. So um, thank you very much and um, I'm grateful to be here. Thank you.